This is us on the side of the road in a random desert. We have no idea where we are. All we know is there's mountains everywhere around. In Spain, there's a law that forces bus drivers to stop every two to three hours. Sometimes these brakes would have us stopping in the middle of nowhere. Here is one of those instances. Children like these would often come out of nowhere. We would give them food, water, or dirham, which is the currency in Morocco. Although our location was unknown, these stops would always give us beautiful scenery. These mountains and the landscape were definitely a sight to see. <laughs> the Medina is one of the largest outdoor markets in the world. Within the Medina was this pharmacy. The pharmacy sold everything from makeup, oils for your skin, and even medicine to clear up your sinuses. Close to the Medina was this leather factory. This is an early part of the process, but next door was a store that sold leather jackets, purses, and even shoes. It was cool to see the leather transform from this to a product you can buy and wear. After spending two nights in the city, we began the more adventurous part of our trip. We were now going to spend two nights in the Sahara Desert. But first, we had to take these 4x4s to our campsite. That ride was probably been the most exhilarating experience while in Morocco. As you can see, it wasn't exactly the smoothest ride. It was one that definitely got your blood pumping. This is our campsite. I'm going to show you the tents and the eating place. This is where we eat, and those are all tents. We sleep in those. Adios. The living arrangements in the desert were definitely interesting. I slept in a 15-person tent. A few feet away was where we ate, and the food was different, but actually very good. As far as scenery goes, the best thing I saw was this sunrise in the desert. My words can't do it justice. Take a look. Can I try one thing? <laughs> Can we get over there before we come on top? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> get over to that dude. <laughs> This is us on camels. Camel? Me. Crazy, huh? Riding on a camel. The camel ride was definitely the finale of the trip. There's not many people that can say they rode a camel through the Sahara Desert, but I'm lucky enough to say I did. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for my next video on Spain.